Hello children, I'm sure you all doing well. Children, today I'm going to teach you drawing, okay? I'm going to teach you to draw one of my favorite fruits. Do you want to know which fruit is that? Let me show you. Can you guess children, which fruit is this? Yes, you guessed it right. It's a watermelon. So now let me tell you a few things about this fruit, okay? A watermelon is a large oval fruit with a hard rind, okay? This covering is hard. Inside, it has red flesh and many black seeds. Can you see these seeds, children? Yes, it has many red, black seeds. It is a very juicy and a refreshing fruit. A very popular fruit in the summers. It has more water and fiber content and helps us to remain hydrated during the hot season. Now it is very good for our skin and also our heart. A watermelon is used to make fruit salads and juices. I'm sure mama gives you juices. Yes, now a watermelon will keep you healthy okay, and strong. So you all must try to eat watermelons. Now let's begin children with our lesson today. Now, before few days, we had learnt W for watermelon, right? We had learnt to write W. Do you all remember how to write W? Yes, a W looks like this. So, we will learn today W for watermelon. We will learn to draw a watermelon slice. I am going to teach you this part. Okay, one slice of a watermelon. So, let's repeat after teacher. W for watermelon will you all repeat children w for watermelon very good now let me show you how to draw a watermelon let's begin children first we will make a sleeping line a big sleeping line i hope you all know how to do it by now a big sleeping line can you see children? Now, from this first end point to the next end point here, to the other end point, we'll make a semicircle or a half curve like this. Okay? So let's begin. Here you go. Here. Okay? You have a curve here. Now, one more curve. Again, from this point to this point, you make one more curve. Here. Isn't it easy? Our watermelon is almost ready. Now for the seeds, we'll make small oval shapes. Okay? Like these seeds. See, look at these seeds. Can you see these oval shapes? Okay? Let's go around. Here. And our watermelon is ready. So we have W for watermelon and this is what a watermelon looks like. Now children, I'm going to teach you how to color a watermelon. Okay, so let me show you the coloring part. So I've already drawn a bigger size over here and I've already colored the black part. Now let me show you how to do this green part. Okay, so last time teacher showed you how to color. So you are going to use one direction, any one direction. So you take a sleeping line, sleeping direction like this. Or you take a standing direction and you start coloring. Okay. And you fill up all the white part. Children see that you don't go out of this black line. You color within the given lines here, within the drawn lines. Don't go out of the borders. Fill up all this white part. So this is how you color. Okay. Slowly you color. And then you go up here. 
cover all the white part with the green color no white part should be seen okay so our green is done the outer rind is done the outer covering is done now what color are you going to put inside can you see here yes it's red color so here we'll use a sleeping position go like that color all this white part Don't color on the black part. Color like this. Cover all this. All the white part. And our juicy watermelon is getting ready. It looks yummy, right? So children, you are going to tell mama to bring watermelon for you. And then you are going to either have watermelon milkshake or juice or you can tell mama to make fruit salad for you don't worry mamas okay mama will get it for you all so our watermelon is almost ready see in children so children i hope all of you all are going to try drawing watermelon today okay go step by step just like how teacher showed you all i've been seeing most of your works many of you all have been also sending me pictures of what you all do so it's wonderful all of you all have almost learned drawing very nicely so our watermelon is ready okay so you all have to practice watermelon and you will also learn to say w for watermelon so whenever teacher gives you draw object for w you will draw watermelon w for watermelon see you soon children god bless bye